every time we go out, we travel at, at least 3,000 miles. So we're, we're, we're spending a lot of time on the road. We've been to a lot of different hotels. So uh, the, the other night, basically, um, a couple days ago, woke up and I thought I had, uh, I thought it was a, there was a tick. It wasn't a tick, it was obviously a bed bug, which I soon found out. There were blood streaks all over my bed. It looked like a massacre. And then if you look really close, you could actually see like tiny little bugs crawling around. Yeah, there were really little ones that were just zooming around too. <laughs> It was really it was like bad. You know, at night, I guess they come out and, and they suck on, they attach themselves to you and then they pull out blood and that's how they feed, like a mosquito. So at night while I was sleeping and I couldn't figure out why I couldn't sleep then, and I was tossing and twisting yeah, and turning. I know, I'm, I'm itching now already <laughs> right. just talking about it. Jeez. So I, I instantly just like freaked out. I mean, I can handle going inside a tornado, but bed bugs chewing on my body, sucking my blood all night while I'm sleeping, disturbing that whole process, and then you have to get up the next day and just drive 18 hours. It wasn't good. I mean, we got all of our rooms comped, which was like, a, which is huge, but it still doesn't take away the fact that I had, you know, bugs feeding on my body, all over my body all night long, and I was violated. It was a terrible experience. I don't know if it was, I mean, Bobo's been carrying, he's a host, man. He's got all kinds of shit. If anything, he infested the hotel. It was a really nice hotel, actually. One of the better ones we've stayed in. Did you check all your cracks and orifices for bed bugs yet? Yeah, I did. I had Chris Chittick do that. Chris checked all my cracks and orifices. We did a full-on uh, uh, body check, cavity check, and I think everything turned out okay. 